Bonjour génie engineers, welcome to my problem a day series. In this video we do a problem on relative density. This is a very straightforward problem. I got a similar question on my FE exam. Now this question is also important if you're taking your solar mechanics class. Now if you're here for the first time and you just want to learn about engineering or just how to engineer a better life, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss out on future videos. Now let's get started. We are giving the unit weight of, for the field density, which is 112 pounds per cubic feet. And we were giving the uh, unit, ma uh, the maximum unit weight and the minimum unit weight. And we need to find the relative density of the field soil. All you need to do is write this equation right here, this one, and then you just plug in. You have all the variables are given to you. So let me write it down so you guys can see what I'm actually talking about. So. This is our relative density. So I have the uh, density D field. I'm just gonna write F for field, just so we can go a little faster. Then I have minus gamma D min. And then for min, I'm just gonna write M. And we're going to divide that by gamma D max. Let's write it as max. So we, we differentiate it from DM minus gamma D M. Um, and then we're going to multiply that by gamma d max divided by gamma d field, which is f, and multiply it by 100. Okay, so gamma d field is 112, gamma d min is 102. Divide that by gamma d max, which is 127, minus 102. Multiply it by gamma d max, which is 127. And then divide that by gamma d f, which is 112. And the whole thing you multiply by 100. Note here that we're going to get a percentage answer. I didn't write the units because everything here is in pounds per cubic feet, which means it's going to cancel out. Okay, so if you plug in that in your calculator, you will get an answer of 45%. So that's going to be your relative density. Okay, guys, so like I said, it was very easy, straightforward problem. Now, on the next video, we're going to do a problem that is slightly harder. We're going to calculate the relative compaction. So make sure you hit the bell so you get notified when I release the video. And don't forget, a problem a day keeps the F away. If you guys have any questions, please leave it in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and make sure you share with your friends who might find it helpful. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you soon. À la prochaine.